Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for joining me today. Uh, so in this video, I'm going to do a review of the new and improved J Casino, formerly known as the Sands in Reno, Nevada. So as you can see, this is the front. Looks a lot more inviting. Nice and colorful. Nice big casino sign. But then, of course, to the right, you still have a whole bunch of construction going on. And there's probably only about 25% of the parking capacity available right now. So parking could be hard to find until they get all this renovations and parking and everything done. So, so when you walk in the doors right here, what do you see? You see a bunch of construction going on. Uh, they're doing a lot of work in here. I did a little bit of research and the owner who bought this place is spending about $300 million to remodel everything as well as he owns half the block and he put a carnival in right behind the hotel actually so if you have kids that might be something cool for you to take there's rides and food and shows and other stuff like that so this is when you first walk in a lot of construction going on uh, this is a picture right here of the future plans etc so this right here is when you're entering the casino my first thoughts were, it looks pretty nice. That's guest services. That's the cage right there and the cashier. They do have a Starbucks. I believe that was a Starbucks on the on the floor when you first walk in. So if you guys love Starbucks, there you go. Uh, me personally, I like the sports books. So they do have a sports books here. Same as they did before, but this one's a little smaller. I don't know if they're going to move it to another location once they keep remodeling. But yeah, they do have a sports books here. Uh, when you walk in right here... Really pretty, nicely done, clean. Looks like they spent a lot of money right here. You know, they got the TV screens up there that change and nice little lobby. It looks pretty clean. So the rest of it right now that you're seeing is a bunch of slot machines. Probably the same slot machines that they had before, but now it's just in a better area. So the layout's a lot different. It's a lot more open. As you can see, um, I will say that the staff was really rude when we did check in. So the front desk staff was pretty rude. But uh, the dealers over at the card tables and the cocktail waitresses, they were very nice. And I guess that kind of made up for what we had to deal with when we first checked in. The pit boss, really nice guy. Took care of me for sure. So uh, compliments to the bosses and all the gaming dealers and everything. So yeah, this area right now, right here, is the games, table games. They probably only have about 8 to 10 tables. It's roulette, blackjack, I believe 3 card poker, and pie gal. I spoke with the pit boss and he said that they're going to be getting the craps table back in there as soon as possible. So I'm guessing it might take a little longer though because they're renovating a lot of things still. Uh, they got the craps, the pop pop craps, I believe that what it, that's what it's called. And they have the video blackjack here as well so i guess uh if you're a craps player you can kind of do that i know it's not the real thing but at least it's something so this is a lounge it is a non-smoking area which is kind of nice you can breathe <laughs> everybody knows that the casino is super smoky so if you need to get away you can come in here and breathe a little bit better and uh you know they got slot machines as well video poker pretty much everything you need so Yep, non-smoking room is really nice. This bar lounge is pretty nice, I would say. Nice and updated. Nice little furniture that you can lounge around, hang out with your friends. Uh, it's got the glow on the wall. Looks like they might have some live music here on the weekends, judging by the piano. But I didn't see any this weekend as I stared there. Uh, as far as uh, crowdedness, it wasn't too crowded the whole time that I was here. And now I know why, because there is so much construction going on. Uh, I did have a terrible experience sleeping here. All we heard all night long was the elevators going up and down. I don't know if it was just the room that they gave us, but I barely got any sleep. A lot of noise going on around here. I should have known better. So that's definitely uh, a concern of mine. Hopefully they can fix that, or if it's just that hotel room. that you Because we're, eh, we're pretty close to the to the elevator so back there there's going to be a steakhouse opening coming soon and this is just the other side of the casino pretty much the same thing that's pretty much the whole thing 
All right, guys, so that was my review of the new J Resort, formerly known as the Sands Casino here in Reno, Nevada. So I hope you guys enjoyed my video and it gave you guys a little bit of an idea on what this place looks like now and what it's gonna be when they're done doing construction. Uh, yeah, that's about it. I would not stay again. Yeah, we would not stay again. I don't like the sound of the elevator going up and down all night. So you guys already heard what I like, what I don't like about this place. In the voiceover, hit the like button, subscribe for more future videos. See ya.